Hello everybody, my name is Tamaria and I forgot my character again. Hello everybody, my name is Tamaria and welcome back to the North Atlantic Petting Zoo. It's been about five months, give or take, since I've done a reintroduction of my titles. And in that time, as you can see here, we have a total of 76 now. Um, there's a lot of them here, there's a lot to go through, so we're just gonna go get right into it. I was gonna do them in order, but that's a lot of work hunting down each and every one, so we're just gonna start with the pasture and the barn first. When I last introduced my titles, I had a total of 42. We have greatly increased that number, and I have 76 now. My very first introduction, I only had 33, so to go from just a 9 jump for the next introduction, to well over 30 is wild. As I'm sure you all can see, the petting zoos had a little bit of an upgrade <laughs> since the last introduction. This is due to them adding island decor and a bunch of other things like that. We just finished the winter event, so I got my bonfires. My orchard over here I haven't harvested. I don't know if I ever will end up doing that. I think it looked kind of pretty. I've just been leaving it here. But the titles have so much space now. Instead of having only 20 on display, we now have a total of 36 on display at any given time. We've got a bunch of signs around the area. <laughs> it's including one that I think any new viewers might want to see. Um, they're all dressed up. We've got Fabuloso over here. We do have a visitor who is not part of my collection. <laughs> Weagles has been over here for a playdate for quite a while. He's going home soon. He'll be fine. Any of my viewers of my streams know that this is where we host Title Trivia. If you don't know what Title Trivia is, it is a section at the end of my streams where I will ask my live chat five questions about the collection. For you guys, I hope that this will help you guys study up on some of the titles and help you get more answers correct. <laughs> you guys have been struggling in the last few days. Um, if you're not a live viewer, I hope to see you stop by sometime. It's always nice to have a couple new faces. I'm gonna have to ask you guys to please excuse the way that I blend in with the floor. <laughs> but we currently have 18 different titles in this barn, and we're gonna go all the way down the list and check them all out. If you can see the sign here, first up we have hand soap. He is very eager to see you, as you can tell by the fact that he is hiding over here. He is a shy little guy, he's personally my second favorite title in my collection, and he was gifted these bunny ears by Kai. I'm pretty sure he's Kai's favorite. Next up, with her very own snow pile in her stall, we have our girl Fridge. She's very sleepy, very cold, and she kind of gets snow everywhere she walks. She doesn't really go out that often unless it's December. We love her though. Next up is a very big boy. His name is Pine Sol. He likes being outside, probably the way he smells. He's really big though, look at him. Bro is huge. Oh, he didn't like that. Many of you guys probably remember witnessing this little guy get dyed during the summer event. This is my guy Cascade. Look at him, he's just a little dude. He's another one of my personal favorites. Next up, we have our always in the Halloween mood, Vaseline. She's sticking her head through the wall, but here she is with her little hat. She's absolutely adorable, and I think she might be my fastest title. He got a whole short dedicated to him. This is Frying Pan. Chat helped me pick and create his outfit, and his aura was given to us by a lovely viewer. Thank you. This next guy's really angry. This is Nail Polish Remover. He just tried to kick me. <laughs> um, he was in fact named by Lois, I believe. This next lovely lady is also always in the Halloween spirit. This is Ajax. Her old name was Aquafina when I got her. Um, she's been here for a while. She was the newest title when I last did an update on them. And she's been here to stay. I love her. One of the original 33. You've seen her in all of these introductions. Here's Kiyute. Our fiery little lady who is also in the wall. Apparently a lot of you guys think that Swiffer is a stallion. I'm here to break the news that Swiffer has and always will be a mare. Here she is. <laughs> 
She is also one of the original 33 and has appeared with her many different appearances in all of the introduction videos. We got another big title over here. We got Hairspray. As you can see, she doesn't have a favorite color. She just really likes all of them. She's like the embodiment of melted crayons. This one's a tiny little guy. This is Oven Mitt. He's one of our newer titles. He's just a little baby. He's wearing, he's rocking the Dorothy witch hat. Look at that. He really said there's no place like home, and home is the North Atlantic Petting Zoo. This next guy was voted to be our Halloween title for the season. This is Bath Bomb. He is quite literally on fire. <laughs> he's so cute. Next up, we have Little Baby Air Fryer. He's just a little dude. His mom is in the next stall over, so we're gonna go check on her. Another one of the original 33, this is Washcloth. Her appearance is a lot different than the first time she was introduced, but this is Air Fryer's mother. I know, you can definitely see the resemblance. She's very caring, very kind, and a little bit angry when she needs to be. Next up, still listening to My Chemical Romance all the time, we have Febreze. He's our emo title, he's always muttering something about being a young boy, but look at him! He's clingy, he loves his mother, me, and he's, uh, he's, he's a lot different than the last time you saw him. New tack, new hair, you name it. Probably a new song, new poems. He's doing his own thing. Next up, we have our Trident lookalike, aka her ex-husband, Triton. He is the father of Spearmint and Mint Bliss, and he is our, well, he, he's a resident, well, He's something. Next up is a large fan favorite. We have Ziploc. Isn't she beautiful? She recently got this aura. I don't remember where she got it from. She just kind of woke up and had it. I'm taking a quick break from introducing the titles to tell you two things. One, probably the most important one, some of the titles will be missing either pieces of their outfits or they will be missing outfits entirely. This is due to the vault, as I have been low on inventory space for a while, so the vault has a lot of my title's clothing. I've, re I've recovered what I can, but some of them still just don't have their outfits. The second thing, as I'm sure a lot of you guys know by now, you can see it in my status, I have a redemption code in Wild Horse Islands. This means a lot to me, as it's been something I've been working towards and low-key hoping for for a very long time, so let me tell you how to redeem it. You go up here to your coin amount and you click it. From there, you click redeem code and you type in Trident, Trident. As you can see, I've already redeemed it. The Trident is actually on Trident. Um, but you type it like this and you will get an adorable accessory. <laughs> if you just want to copy paste the code, it'll be in the description as well. For the sake of ease of access, we are going to do the inventory titles next, as catching the pasture titles long enough to give them an introduction is a little bit hard with 18 of them in there. It's hard to keep track of who I've already recorded and who I haven't, so we'll do them last. We are going to start with the girl herself first. This is Trident with her Trident. The code is in my bio. You'll also see it at the beginning of this video, and it's in the description. Um, she is my main title and my my favorite, my absolute favorite. She's wild caught and I caught her myself and she's been with me since. She is really the foundation of this collection. Definitely one of the newer titles that a lot of you guys haven't seen yet. This is Snoop Dogg. Snoop Dogg was a recent Christmas present. Thank you, Jay. And does not have a tax set yet. We're working on it. We're getting everybody sorted out as soon as I can. Also sadly missing his tag set, but he's got his pinwheel. We have Sunny D. He, I believe I got him during the summer event. So he's not that new, but he isn't one of my original 33. Often confused as being a mare, this large, massive boy is pink stuff. His outfit is very fitting for his name, I'm aware. <laughs> he's super cute. I haven't bonded with him a lot, but I love his outfit, and it's still in progress, so I can't wait to see where it goes. 100% a newer title, this is Snuggles. Snuggles' tag set is also incomplete, however, most of the stuff on her is from her previous owner. 
I think she's absolutely precious, and I love her name. Currently without a theme or a tax set, this is Rubber Ducky. He is new, he was not in the last video. There's about 34 that weren't in the last video. <laughs> so I won't keep saying that they're new. Um, you guys can kind of guess which ones weren't in the video before. This lovely lady gifted to me right before Christmas as a gift is wrapping paper. She is named because she was the very first one given to me for Christmas and I love her. Part of a duo, this is Washer. She is very obviously themed in red and white for Christmas, which is around when I got her. The other half of the, that duo, this is Dryer. His tax set is not as completed as hers is. However, he is also themed around Christmas. He will be her green counterpart. This next title has a name that a lot of you guys have been requesting. It's finally no longer tagged out. I'd like you all to meet Scrub Daddy. He is also part of a duo. And for that duo, this is Scrub Mommy. I'm so glad it's no longer tagged out because I've been wanting to use these names for a very long time. Next up, we have one of our purple ladies. This is Water Balloon. She was title number 34. She also lost her tag set to the vault, but you know, we're working on that. Formerly named Tsunami, this next guy is Carvana. Um, I'm not really familiar with the brand that he is named after, as I did not name him, Xander did. You know him, you love him, this is Mr. Clean. And despite what a lot of you thought, Mr. Clean is a stallion, look at him. Mm -hmm. Next up, she looks very similar to Washer, I know, but this is Confetti. Confetti was my first title in 2024. She was given to me right on New Year's Day. It's our minty fresh boy himself, here is Colgate. Mm -hmm. Wearing one of my favorite dyes, this is Lovely Lady Spatula. She was almost named Hair Gel, however, my live chat voted to name her Spatula instead. Now, I will admit, this title is my least favorite. However, I still love her. Her name is Hairbrush. Next up, we have Kleenex's brother. This is Lysol. This is a very tiny little guy. This is Mint Bliss. He is Trident's second child. Usually dressed in neon blue, we have my boy Lampshade. After Lampshade, we have Dish Rack. Another Fire Fade title. This one is a stallion, and his name is Crockpot. Next up, we have title number 35. That is her actual number in the herd. This is Chlorine. Usually wearing pearly green. This is our boy Screwdriver. This lovely girl is usually dressed in icy green. This is Lupa. She was title number 50. You probably know this next title as he is a little bit of a movie star. This is Walker. You know him probably from Kai's channel. Um, he just recently last month became a permanent resident of the North Atlantic Petting Zoo. At the time of making this video, this little guy is our newest title. This is Pipe Cleaner. Another one of our big titles. This is Capri Sun. Isn't she cute? This is a title I traded for from Tango. His name is Spray Bottle. He's usually dressed in pearly blue. Missing some pieces of her tax set. Here is Snowdrift. Known for suing tiny children when they try to flip him, this is Water Bottle. Another fan favorite and a very popular surfer if he knew how to surf, this is Hawaiian Punch. You don't see it right now, but this is our lovely girl Barbie doll. One of the newer titles, I'd like to imagine she kind of hates Christmas, this is Cheese Grater. Another really tiny little man, this is Fabric Softener, he is the son of Kleenex. Pretty chronically online, this is my boy Spork. Next up, this is our girl Tropicana. Another mother and one of the original 33, this is our lovely lady OxyClean. I'm sure you guys can see the resemblance, but this is Bug Juice. And our final inventory title, this is Teaspoon. This lovely lady right here is Fabuloso. She's quite possibly one of my favorites. Followed by our lovely lady in pink, this is Kitchen Sink. My clingy little boy and my third favorite title, this is Dish Soap. 
Over here in her little boppers, please let me see you. This is Play-Doh. <laughs> Next up, we have Lemon Pledge. She is a big lady. We've got our little guy sunscreen. He's just a little dude. We've got our actual little dude in terms of height. I'm sorry. Tap water. And our lazy man, who I don't really know why he came over here. Dishwasher! Next up, we have our girl who is also lazy. Conditioner. I gotta find someone to have it introduced. In Prismatic, we have Bathtub. Our girl Kleenex is over here. She is the mother of Fabric Softener. Our Christmas boy, Paper Towel. We've got two more over here. <laughs> Three more, possibly. Come here. This next one is Body Wash. She's also very small. And then we've got our independent boy all the way over here. This is Magic Eraser. He is also one of my personal favorites. I can't lie. <laughs> and finally, we have Shampoo and Spearmint. Shampoo is right here. She is the twin sister of Conditioner. And finally, we have Spearmint. You can tell it's her because she's got glitter coming off of her. This girl is not friendly for the ecosystem. We have one more in the pasture that I haven't introduced you guys to yet. And this is our girl dinner plate. Because she's independent, I didn't have a chance to see her the first time. But this is her. She's one of our newer titles and she was named by my sister Mel. Isn't she classy? I love her. And with that, that is all 76 of my titles. Do you guys have a favorite? Let me know in the comments. As always, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And remember to use my redemption code. It'll be in the description below. And it's also always on my island in-game. The code is Trident's Trident. It'll give you this lovely Trident accessory that my girl is modeling here. Thank you guys so much for watching. It means a lot. And good morning for now.